Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, going to go over really quickly what in the world is going on with Shiba Inu this morning in the crypto markets, up about 8% or so at the time of making the video. Going to go over some key resistance levels for SHIB and kind of give you my thoughts moving forward. So, uh, currently, we're up uh, about 7 8% for the day, and we're going to draw out this little channel here to see exactly where we need to go or what we need to do in order to basically confirm the breakout and we're pretty close to uh, what we're needing to do here so the uh, the bottom seems to be around 4022 and we keep kind of going down there popping our head keep going down there popping our head if we can get to 25 a little over 25 here when I say 2.5, I mean these numbers here, then we're going to be in good shape. Basically, if we can pop our head, as you see, 2.5 is right here. So if we can get a green candle or a couple of green candles, a, a candle and a confirmation candle to get through that channel there. And I think that we're going to be off to the races from there. And then we're going to come up and retest this 30 level and the next leg up would be 35. Okay, so that is the uh, one year chart just to kind of give you an idea of what we're looking at longer term and here's the daily chart we actually i mean from the time of me starting to talk about shiba inu dropped a few percent in price we were up about eight and a half percent a few minutes ago and but you see here all the way from 216 this is a, a pretty big shoot up in price and we're not that far off from that 25 level so you're roughly about six seven percent from hitting that two five level where we need to bust through that channel okay so keep an eye on shiba inu today and over the next couple of days to see if it does indeed break through that channel or if we get rejected again if we get rejected again and start coming down and then break below that two two um i think just two two level in general would be like actually this level here this two one six Let's call it that. If we go down again and we bust below there, you could see uh, one sevens and then four zero one seven, four zero one five. But big thing is if we can continue to go higher, hit through that point oh 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 two five level, that'll be huge for Shiba Inu. And of course, we're keeping an eye on Bitcoin overall to see how Bitcoin's doing. And uh, this is the year chart developing that bull flag there and this is the one day chart up about three percent as you see it looks it's going to look kind of similar to how uh, shiba's chart is it's basically going to be modeling what bitcoin is doing here so you're seeing a slight pullback in the crypto markets now because we had a pretty decent spike up while everyone was sleeping so and now a little bit of pullback hopefully we'll recover and continue to go higher for um, for Bitcoin and for the crypto market just in general. I think that we need to get above uh, Let's say I say 63 and a half or 64 Thousand if we can get above there and then start making our way back up to 70, but overall if We're gonna make this thing run. It's gonna have to go past 70. I think if it gets past 70,000 again Then we have a good shot of continuing the uptrend and people are you know kind of freaking out and wondering why bitcoin dropped well you see this triple top here that pattern i knew this was coming i honestly thought we were going to go down to fifty thousand before we start making a recovery i'm not sure if that's still in play or not but i hope not i hope that the uh, the downfall is over and we're going to start making our way higher so keep an eye on about sixty four thousand five hundred for bitcoin see if we can get there shiba inu four zero and two five Alright guys, all I got for you, let me know your comments below. Other than that, we'll catch you in the next one.